All right, this is for venting out uh, basically a range hood for a gas stove. So we're going to add gas to this particular range. It's totally open underneath and there is already uh, dual heat in the house. So to tee off a line actually looked pretty easy. All right, so see the location of that? The center of the stove is 66 inches from the wall. It's a 30 inch wide unit. Now, you see that. The reason why I'm showing you the soffit is because if we look, see that? There's a running line. We have another room over here. Okay, so you're like, well, what's the big deal? Well, we just bent out the roof. Well, the deal is the deal is is that right there. So it's the main soffit line there. So Matt, what I need you to determine, if you can on here, is how do we vent this out properly. If you think we can do that without any condensation issues, unless you somehow wrap the pipe. We know that's their soffit system. And just blow it out. Man, I don't know. Blow it out. But I have the 3D drawings. So once again, here's kind of the divide there goes out you have 34 inches of shingle roofing up top there like you see how thick that shingles were those are 34 inches so now we're going in here just to the right of the window is that soffit that maybe we we're thinking that accent was going to build a chase down a little bit if you need and we'll just re case Oh, I got a customer. Uh, or if we can, we'll go through the ceiling. So that's 12 and a half inches tall, 26 and a half inches wide. Those re those casters are seven inches. All uh, right, there the gap between that is 22 inches. The set the center of the light is 50 inches from that wall. And in the center of that light is 80 inches from that wall. The center of that is 66 inches from that wall. The gap between the two, uh, the top and the soffit will be uh, 47 and 5 eighths, I think. Alrighty.